Yo, I have an actual W boyfriend and he just did this for me. Like legit. We're right here and then the truck still kind of has some of the roses. So the lie was just taking forever. So he told me to come to the park and then he asked me to be his valentine. Oh! W man. W fucking man. Look at him. <laughs> we have so many flowers. So we're giving the ones on the styrofoam to like subscribers. That it's dark now. Basically, I waited here till I died. And then I took the Benz back to the house. Got the blazer. Because my tripod and the Benz didn't work. Just so much shit. Now we're in the blazer. The lies finally done with their video. And we can fight. What you say? Wow. Talking about the devil. Oh my god. You're not starting this again. Wait, why'd you give me this sweater to put on? We're sponsored by this. Oh, guys, we're sponsored by Brooklyn. Team. Oh, oh Team. Did you ask if we could go? Yeah. I already said it. I'll fucking ask us on the one. Jump around, chill. Find Nelly a boyfriend. That's cool. <laughs> it's a joke, bro. Dad, you want to give me money? We're just going to Starbucks. Oh, now I can pay. Do you like my piercings? Nothing. What? Dad! Nelly! <laughs> Let me light you up. Get me right, like, get me right. <laughs> oh, the big ass forehead got in the way. Mom! She took me. This generation has issues. I'm just kidding. Grandmas be like. My dad be like. <laughs> <laughs> Jump scare. In conclusion, the lies off the fucking rail. Oi, la troca. Yo, where's that AMG? We're gonna be subscribers. That Broke. You're broke. Where's your blazer at? What color is your blazer? We're gonna start now. Like, we're gonna hammer you with questions. Alright, we got so many. Here's the deal. We are going to do a little QA drive with us. Finally, an hour later. Like, Nelly's just the busy queen and you gotta be in her schedule. Anyways, yeah, our so sweaters cool. are from Timu. This video is sponsored by Timu. Timu is an online marketplace that offers the most competitively priced products in multiple categories. So they have home decor, pet supplies, fashion, jewelry, and so much more. They sent over a few items. I will show you guys what it looks like in person. And this is what it looks like online with pricey. So everything is priced super, super well. The quality is super nice and soft. You can tell that you're getting a good price for a good product. I've been super into working out. So I got these cute little shorts that do have the butt scrunch in the back and they just look super, super cute. Legit, where are my bad bunny fans? Look at these so freaking cute. And they're so soft. Look at the material. It's like a Sherpa, super soft and it's padded so your foot will not hurt. I got my favorite lip mask from there. This feels so good on my lips. It smells so good and it comes with the little applicator right here. So relatable, me as hell. This is so cute. This is actually me. I got this car tripod. This is for my phone. So you hook it up to your little vent when you need the navigation and stuff. Look at this. Super cute. They just have the most affordable, nice, and useful stuff. You guys know my obsession with hats. So I got a black one that just says New York. So freaking cute. Again, super affordable prices. Timu offers free shipping for new users and it gives you 90 days to return anything that you don't like or doesn't fit you well. quality products for a fraction of the price where they would be super, super expensive anywhere else. Team will also accept all the major credit cards, Google Pay, Apple Pay, PayPal, and even the programs that offer Afterpay like Klarna and Afterpay. Timu is completely safe and legit. If you click the link in the description box, you will get 30% off or you can use my code right here. If you want to shop with a more smooth experience, Timu does have an app. You can download it and shop straight through there. My favorite thing about Timu is that it just has super cute little crews like this. You guys know crewnecks are my favorite thing ever and this is super soft. You just get a deal. I'm always losing my socks since Timu did send me some of these. They sent me some gray ones, brown and black. So I am fully stocked. Thank you so much to Timu for sponsoring today's video. We have to go get Starbucks first, of course. What we're gonna do is place a mobile order of a drink for me, and I'm gonna place a drink for you. Like. So Cut. something that is really out of your comfort zone. But don't be a dick. Like, you actually have to drink it. If you get me watching that, you will be disowned. <laughs> we have the app right here. We're gonna mobile order our coffee or whatever we're gonna get. <laughs> oh! I got the little kid car. I got that iPad kid coffee. You got that disease in you, boy. I got that dog in me. <laughs> No lie. On a scale of 1 to 10, how much do you love school? School or soccer? I just like soccer. Oh. Yeah, soccer is the only reason I go to school. I have the biggest headache in the entire world right now. Yeah. Seeing the lie making it worse. I'm like your uh. bestie bestie. You guys, you have matching ring. You have any? <coughs> no, if you did not get me some fucking caffeine, I'm going to. Oh, shit. Oh my god, I've seen the flowers she caught you. Those were so cute. Are you sad? Period, yeah. So sad. So sad. Ah! Yeah. <laughs> Stop coughing! Ventilation, please. All right, no lie. Your drink better be fire no cat if you got me some acai i'm gonna beat it's your ass get me out of this car right about now why do i have such a headache the thought of you <laughs> <laughs> me off. i wasn't crying <laughs> don't look at my forehead 
<laughs> what did it feel like? It didn't feel like anything. It was just like a little ping. It was like a pinch. Literally. Literally. That's literally Lou Lake for Fortnite. Huh? Please tell me you've seen that. <laughs> I always feel like I live my life on TikTok and then I hang out with Nelly and I'm like, nope. She lives her life on TikTok. This, this is literally Lou Lake from Fortnite. <laughs> oh, oh. I swear, every time I hang out with you, you're sick. Dude, <clears throat> let me explain this time. I don't know why I'm sick, honestly. I had gotten over my sickness, and now I got the little kid cough. She was kissing a sick guy. And I'm like, you need to practice? Disgusting. I haven't kissed no one in so long. In so long? Has Nelly Cross confirmed that she has had her first kiss? No, that's what I meant. I've never kissed no one. Nah, you said so it's so long. Reply. I haven't kissed no one in so long. Cut. Oh, Papa Cuevas, you see this? Shut up. Gonna get me cut up. I've never had my first kiss. The shark emoji. <laughs> Please tell me you know what I'm talking about. Yep. <laughs> we'll get that tea for you guys right now. After Mom and dad are not allowed to watch this video. Please. Mom and dad click out right now. Right Dude, this is the longest line in the entire world. Actually, no, it's not even long. It's because they're taking forever. Hi, we have two mobiles, Natalie and Nelly. Everyone thinks Nelly is a nickname. Like, no. Yes, no. Nah, they screwed you over. No, nah, for real. Why do I have a four letter name? <laughs> Did they me. did you wrong. That's like fucking John. Literally, you're a John. Bro, I feel the sick vibes in here. You're giving me the fumes. <coughs> Ugh, disgusting. Let's pull up some questions, shall we? Huh? How is life since Nat moved out? Amazing. She's literally lying. That's actually good, because I feel like we get along more now. But you were a little prick when I lived there. Okay. She misses me. Yeah. Did you ever like your coach? Uh -oh. No! <laughs> I never liked him. Everyone says I did. Oh, got me so mad. Oh, he got her so mad, guys. What's the name of this guy again? Mr. Lopez. Mr. Lopez. <laughs> Next question. No, he was in love with this guy. No, I wasn't. Does she have a crush on anyone? Don't think about it. Currently, you do. Just admit it. It's not a crush, though. And it's someone older than her. Wait, no! no! I have to catch you up on that, but I can't do it on camera. The crush has gone away. <gasps> you got the ick? Yes. Oh, uh, no way. Okay, tell us your top two icks. Top two icks? Talk about my sister and say she's hot. <laughs> <laughs> and second one, trying to like bully me because I'm famous. But like, he would say in the weirdest way. Like I would say, oh yeah, I can't go out because like I don't got money right now. He's like, but you're famous. Oh yeah, that's an ick. Why? He invited you out? I wasn't gonna go out regardless. Wait, where did he invite you? He just said to go to his soccer game. I wasn't gonna go. And my mom would have let me go out either way. Isn't he like a lot older? Like two years older. <laughs> Goodbye. Adios. This is the net lie support. I talked about this on live before. I don't care. So is she talking to someone? No. Nah, we just answered that question. He was the guy that you were gonna talk to? We didn't even start like the talking sting. Yeah. I got the ick and then I was like, nah. So no, I'm not talking to anyone currently. Currently? <laughs> we'll keep you updated. Hi. There, Hi. Right? Yes. Oh my god, now like, if you got me that drink that's right there, I'm going to lose my mind. The pink drink. The color pink. With puree. <laughs> you don't like puree? No! One time we got it and you drank it all. Nelly puree? No, the strawberry the cream frappuccino. Did you at least put a banana in it? You didn't let me. You go and drink it. Don't fuck that drink. I hate this girl. I was gonna get you a matcha one, but I didn't know what you liked in your matcha. You Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. I'm shitting Brooks right now. I'm not drinking that. I'm not drinking right. it. I got in a lie. Matcha latte with whole milk because they didn't have oat. A shot of espresso, sweet cream, cold foam. Try it. I think you'll really like it. I think that you're being a hater. Yeah, you like it. The cold foam. Okay, drink all of it. It actually doesn't taste like matcha. Oh, look That's at that. <laughs> this is the worst thing I've ever had in my life. No cat. Switch rooms? Please let me keep this. No. I'm just kidding, you can have it. Oh, thank you. I needed the caffeine. How is it like being Natalie Cuevas' sister? Is it amazing? Natalie Cuevas as a person, not a YouTuber, is very great. Sometimes, I like to preface that. But having her as a YouTuber is not that great. I was getting bullied in middle school. I kind of still am, but it's fine. We make the bag and leave. Yeah, milk right? your sister and y'all leave. Oh, okay, no. Nah. Whenever you see me and Nelly making videos, it's because we're on good terms. Right now, we're like on good terms, but like she's looking at getting mad, so I don't think we're going to be on a video again for a while. <laughs> yeah, she made me wait too long. So you won't see that life for a few minutes. Is she excited for her 15? Mm -hmm. But I'm nervous. I'm not nervous about the 15. I'm mm -hmm. nervous about the dances, the waltz, and the surprise dance. The waltz. What if I mess up? What if I fall? You know that I didn't like ask me to be in her court? You didn't ask me to be in your court. You were a little kid. You're an old kid. <laughs> would have pulled out my dancing skills, but nope. Would you like to be in my court? No. <laughs> see, that's what you would have said. I would have said you yes. I would have said yes. No. Biggest goal you have set for yourself this year. I think my number one goal is to like get faster at editing. I don't think that ever changes. Either be faster or be more like efficient with my time. Like, like <laughs> chasing a ball. <laughs> chasing the ball cured my depression. You chasing the ball led you to meet people which gave you the depression. 
Okay. Say so be on your podcast, I'll talk about it. Are there set expectations for you that your sisters didn't have, or is it more chill? It's more chill. Have you gotten a hickey? No. I can officially tell you I have not gotten a hickey. Were you close to getting it? And I have not given one either. Will you be going to college? Currently, I don't want to go to college. It's a maybe because like I would love to have like a job like and be like oh yeah I'm a nurse every job comes with a lot of stress I just feel like college comes with double that stress you know sometimes I do wish I was a professional like when people ask oh what do you do I'm a youtuber like you know how dumb that sounds obviously you know youtuber is an actual job but it would sound better if I could say I'm a videographer you know what I'm trying uh, to hear you know what I would get my degree in either graphic design or graphic video I think being a professional is like really cool have you ever tried to smoke no I don't break my pinky promises that's how you guys know I'm being for real. have you ever smoked? No. I fuck with my lungs. Would she date Joelle? No! She's lying. Joelle's ugly. She's lying. I'm sorry. You know what's so funny? I'm gonna expose both of them right now, okay? I'm gonna expose both of you guys. They are literally the most funniest people ever because they both play such hard to get, but they throw little shots at each other. Like, both of them, like, they'll do little things here and there. Like, now I'll be like, Joel K, or whatever. Like, (laughs) shut up! He didn't want his attention! Listen! I do that because he did it to me! See? See? See what I mean? Like, they play this little game of, you said, she said, and they're in the same age group. He's not a senior. He's a junior. He's 16. But you were talking to Junior right now? We weren't talking. I've talked to Joel like twice. And I don't approve of Joel. Joel, if you're watching this, all the smoke, bro. I don't approve of you. Joel's the definition of that one kid at your school. Yeah, that one cut. That one cut. <laughs> Let's talk about this more on the podcast. We're gonna have to lie on the podcast one of these days. We don't know when. Don't tell my mom I'm going on the podcast because then she's gonna watch it. Have you ever tried to score and missed? I don't know if they meant soccer or like oh like bag someone. Yeah. Well, actually, tell us, tell us. I followed him for like a week and then he got ugly. He cut his hair off. He had like a mullet, right? And he wasn't super ugly. The only thing nice about him are his teeth. Oh, maybe that's why. And then he cut his hair. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Jump scare! Not lie. This is a trigger warning next time, bro. He went from like a solid like eight and a half to a two, bro. <laughs> See, this is what I don't get about guys. It's like guys don't really have anything. They don't have like makeup. They don't really have anything that can like you know make them a little bit better. The one thing they have is their haircut, and then they do that shit like really, bro. Because usually when you like a guy's story, they look at your cow and they follow you back. I've never shot my shot. Anyway. You like the story? Yeah, I would just Cringe. like the story. Ugh. Anyway, what other questions you got? Can we do a flying Dutchman with grilled onions, please? And then a double double with grilled onions two out of a fries and then one without spread no. that look like i remember when you took me to medium crazy bro, i'm talking about this negativity shut up bro why this isn't you exposing me it's me <laughs> exposing you <laughs> boy <laughs> drama the ball blocker he's gonna text you and be like don't talk about me in the podcast i haven't blocked damn she blocked him because if i didn't block him i would text him oh no! <laughs> and lies going through it y'all oh i'm gonna expose you i'm gonna <laughs> expose you so the lie sent no. me a thing you <laughs> show it you will go to hell. This is why I don't tell them I vote drama no more. Right? So now I sent me a TikTok of something. <laughs> what did you think was going to happen? He was going to be like, oh, no, who he gave does. you flowers? If he would have said what he said, yes, I would. But what he said, what he said hurt my feelings. But no, now I will not be taking this man back. You good? You want me to blow in your eyes? They're getting a little watery. <laughs> now I is in her healing era. Like what a good thing. Go. Ah! So when a light went to my house and she was taking a shower, she played Still I Think About You by a boogie. Come on, this is your song, you lie. You really love her, don't ever tell a bitch that you really love her. Give me a little bit. Give me a little bit. Give me a little bit. Do it over again. I didn't want it to end. I didn't want it to end. My depressed era. That's how I know all the lyrics. Same. <laughs> you know what's so funny? I seen a lie and I see me like three years ago. You'll get over it. Over you're gonna it. find a Jake and you're gonna have this in your life. You need the depressed era to become the happy era. You know, yeah. because you have to be able to value your happy era. The only way you're gonna value it is by having Okay, stop with era. this advice. You're gonna make me cry. I'm not gonna Next song. So we got uh, Flying Dutchman. We got the lies double double and then two animal fries why did you park next to someone that's in their car bro my dad set up security cameras outside our house i'm sneaky i've never snuck out if y'all are gonna ask that next question except for with natalie this is amazing mm. <laughs> i'm 
<laughs> What's something you never told your family? Hmm. Confess. Have I told you about my first kiss? No, tell us now. Find it out on channel two. Was it long ago? Eighth grade. It was in eighth grade? Do you regret your first kiss in the life? Fuck yeah. Why? Was it because of the person? Yeah. And also it was a weird first kiss. We're not discussing no details, but. Thoughts on Joel. Everyone's asking about Joel and Nelly. I don't even follow him on Instagram, guys. Not my They play such hard to get. Is she ever jealous of you? I'm jealous of my relationship. Yeah, I wish I had something like y'all. If Nat ever moved back in, how would you feel about it? I wouldn't even see you that often. I got school. But how would you feel? As long as you don't touch my room, we're good. It wouldn't work. Is that what you were singing at 1 a.m.? Every broken heart I'll admit it. This is my jam. Got a feeling that I'm going under. I'll be needing stitches to make it hard for me. You just smile. Drew's world was my shit when I was going through it. She told me put my heart in the bag. Thought that we were meant to be. Your love is suicidal. I hope you miss me. But better now. this bitch or something. <laughs> it is so hot. See, that's what happens when you get in your fields. You get hot. Now, like, what is your dream car? I don't have one. Oh, actually, I do. I, I want Jake's car. truck. Bro. She wants the that Mama Lona. I hate trucks that are lowered, but yeah. lifted trucks are fire. Favorite soccer player. Nelly's done with soccer players. You gotta move on to, like, basketball boys or something. I, I do got a favorite basketball boy. I'm telling you about him off camera. See what I'm trying to say? Nelly is just living that tea life. The basketball boy is my favorite basketball boy, but he's my best friend basketball boy. Oh, the best friend, y'all. Don't take not, it no other way. Not the best friend. Friend. All right, we just got home guys. Well, Nelai's home. That's gonna conclude today's video y'all We got a lot of juicy tea out of Nelai. That wasn't even juicy. Wait until then. Podcast. The podcast will get a little bit more juice out of this lady But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this video and we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!